Um, obviously, I wished he had made a different statement, uh, but I think that now that has uh, been uh, clarified um, uh, based on his uh, uh, late reactions uh, uh, to this. And so um, um, I, don't, I don't think I want to go any further than that. I mean, could someone else be looking at how to do this uh, relative to our elections, uh, possibly rogue states, whatever? Uh, we know others have potential capability, but it's undeniable that the Russians are taking the lead on this. Uh, basically, they are the ones that are trying to undermine our basic values, uh, divide us uh, with our uh, allies. They are the ones that are trying to wreak havoc over our election process. We need to call them out on that. It's critical that we do so, um, and to then take steps to make sure that they are not able to do this with the election coming up. Again, we should be very wary around the former KGB leader who is leading their nation. A lot of things point to, look, I mean, it's, it, I think anybody who thinks that Vladimir Putin doesn't have his stamp on everything that happens in Russia is, is, is misinformed. Um, it is very clear that virtually nothing happens there of any kind of consequence that Vladimir Putin doesn't know about or hasn't ordered. I think we're pretty sure about that.